And we're going to see if the squishy's here. Squisher! Squisher! It's Squisher! My sweet baby's back! Where the chicky Squishy? You did it! Let's get that Squishy! Egg Unleshy presents Squirrel Hunting with a $5,000 scope can, and this thing is crazy. Welcome to another episode of the Egg Unleshy channel. If you're a sub of this channel, you know I've been obsessed with bringing you the absolute best quality scope cam footage possible. Uh, there's a lot that goes into that, but from a product perspective, it's about the camera, the lens, the scope cam mount, and then the scope itself. And then most importantly though, how well they all play together. So the output is really the sum of these individual parts. So like a $3,000 scope doesn't necessarily mean that the footage is gonna be better than a $500 scope if they don't work together well. So however, uh, if you do buy super high quality equipment and they work together, that's when your footage is gonna be nuts. And this is exactly what we're gonna do in this video. So this is hands down the best setup you can buy as it's the unicorn of scope cam systems. It's all high quality stuff and it works perfectly together. So I'll dive into a little bit uh, each of these individual products as we progress through this video. But first, let me thank today's video sponsor for helping make the quest for the ultimate scope cam footage possible. Believe it or not, sometimes there's a bit of a lull at the table for one, and during those times, games like today's video sponsor, Fishing Clash, come in real handy. This game is super addictive, and it's an absolute blast to play. So I'm going to drop a link to the top of the description and in the pinned comment for you to go download it. The graphics are incredible for a mobile game, and the gameplay itself is simple enough to quickly jump right in and have some fun throughout the day. Uh, there's a bunch of different locations, so it's never going to get boring either. I play this thing all the time, and actually so does my six-year-old son. Uh, he prefers to fish from the boat, but uh, I'm more of a bank guy, and lucky enough you can do both in Fishing Clash. You've got tons of lure choices, different rods, and some sick upgrades. Speaking of that, uh, after you download the game, make sure to use my code FISHWITHLESHY, as you're seeing me type here. This is going to get you $20 in upgrades absolutely free. like. This three-star rod, a mythical lure, 50 luck power-ups, and we all know how important luck is in fishing, and 30 uh, way power-ups, which will help you land some of these monsters. Uh, you can earn these upgrades as you play, or you can use my code and get them immediately for free. Uh, another cool feature is the ability to play with friends and family within their online gameplay. My username is EdgunLeshy, so go in and create your clan uh, within the game and send me an invite, and I'll try to come join you and maybe I'll teach you how to fish. Uh, one quick thing, uh, before we get back uh, to the video, supporting the sponsors of this channel directly impacts my ability to invest the time and money to continue to bring you guys weekly Pew Pew videos. So uh, do me a huge favor uh, and go download this game using the link in the description or that pinned comment and uh, help support uh, the sponsors who support me. Thanks again to Fishing Clash for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back to the action. This is one of the cleanest shots I've ever captured footage wise. Uh, it's a double tap, which makes it even more impressive uh, given that there's all this movement going on. Watch right here as I freeze it and then zoom in and you can literally see the imperfections of the paint within the skirt of the pellet. I'll slow it down one more time and I'm going to go real slow this time so you can see this flight path. A major component of the footage you're seeing in this video uh, is the net result of the scope itself. So the FX 4.5 by 28 wide angle has the best glass you could put on a scope. It's all handmade in Japan and is one of the best all-around scopes on the planet in my opinion. 
but the fact that it marries well with the Eagle Vision GoPro scope cam and their lens is why I'm able to show you what it looks like to truly look down a $3,500 optic. I sometimes like to mix things up and I use the remote system from Tacticam to show some different angles with these cameras downrange. Uh, I use them with different mounts directly on the gun too so I can capture like a POV uh, for non-scope cam kind of shots as well. Some of these close-ups really help illustrate how much power these modern-day air guns like the Leshy 2 are delivering. Uh, the energy dumps that you're seeing here are just incredible. I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. I got a crazy stat for you. Uh, only 22% of the viewers on this channel are actual subscribers. So based upon the amount of unique viewers this channel gets each month, we have line of sight to 1 million subs. <laughs> I mean, how funny would it be if we got this channel to that insane milestone? And with your help, we could actually accomplish that. So, and make folks like this just go absolutely mental. Uh, smash that button uh, and let's make this happen. Uh, if you're part of the 22% already, I really appreciate that and thank you. Uh, but make sure to like and drop a comment as that plays a big role in the algorithm recommending this video. So I know it's annoying uh, to have creators constantly asking you guys to subscribe, like, comment. But in all honesty, it's my biggest ammo against the Snowflake cancel party who takes advantage of these same tools to mass report and try to control the content that you're allowed to watch. So thanks again, guys, and the, uh, I guess, six to nine ladies who subscribe to this channel. Now let's get back to the action. So I'm using the Eagle Vision Universal Scope Cam Mount in their 4K, uh, what is it, F1.8 lens. So this lens just lets in a ton of light, which plays a big role in the clarity of the footage. The GoPro Hero 7 allows me to film at 240 frames per second in a full 1080p. So this is a critical component for the best quality footage. Uh, the camera just absolutely has to film at 240 frames per second at a full 1080p, not 720, 1080p. The issue with the specs I just mentioned though comes down to ease of use. So this video is about showing you the best of the best when the measurement is footage quality. Dicking around with a camera in the woods is not going to be fun for some of you guys. Uh, and there are setups, though, like the ATN x 4K Pro, which I use all the time, which are incredibly easy to use. It's a focus lever and a single press of the button to turn the video on and off. It films great, as you can see, but this is 120 frames per second at 1080p versus the 240 so it's just so much smoother in 240. Uh, this is also um, a decimal point cheaper, really. So obviously, price plays a, a role, too, in people's personal budgets. So I have a video where I did not, actually not too long ago on the different scope cam uh, comparisons and why I use different ones for different situations. I'll throw a card up if you want to go check that out right now. This one isn't the greatest shot, but uh, I'm including it here as the squirrel is moving in and out of a lot of different lighting conditions, similar to what you might find out in the woods. So you can see how well this system did as I followed him down to his final resting place here.
going to wrap up this video with this crazy double tap. Thanks again to Fishing Clash for sponsoring today's video. Make sure to click the link in the pinned comment to download the really cool fishing game. And thanks again, guys. Chat at you soon. Thanks for watching the Ed Gun Leshy channel. Want more backyard hunting videos? Grab your favorite beverage and get yourself caught up. There's hundreds just like the one you just watched. Here's a couple favorites to get you started.